When this sad dog was found wandering the streets and upon taking it to the shelter, he didn't want to be attached to anyone at the shelter. He wasn't mean or aggressive, just a really sad dog until one day when he saw someone special standing in front of him. His reaction will leave you with all the good tears running down your face, so grab some tissues. This is a great story of love and of never giving up hope. Max, a golden retriever with a shiny coat and bright, curious eyes, was the pride and joy of Mr. and Mrs. Johnson. They had adopted him as a small puppy, and since then, Max had brought immense happiness to their lives. Max's days were filled with laughter, playful fetch sessions in the park, and long walks in the countryside. He loved to chase butterflies, roll in the grass, and wag his tail vigorously whenever he saw his beloved owners. Mr. and Mrs. Johnson cherished Max's companionship, and in return, they showered him with love, affection, and delicious treats. One sunny morning while Mr. Johnson was working in the garden, a sense of restlessness overwhelmed Max. The enticing aroma of freshly mowed grass and blooming flowers beckoned him beyond the confines of his familiar backyard. As Mr. Johnson was tending to the roses, Max noticed that the garden gate was slightly ajar. Curiosity sparked in Max's heart, and with a burst of energy, he squeezed through the gap and darted out onto the quiet street. His paws hit the pavement, and an exhilarating sense of freedom enveloped him. The world outside his home was filled with endless possibilities, and Max was determined to explore every nook and cranny. Unbeknownst to Max, Mr. Johnson had realized his mistake just a moment too late. He called out Max's name in a panic but his voice was drowned by the sounds of chirping birds and distant traffic. Mr. Johnson's heart sank as he watched his loyal companion disappear around the corner, disappearing from sight. Panicked, Mr. Johnson rushed inside the house, calling for his wife. Mrs. Johnson's eyes widened in alarm as she saw the anguish etched on her husband's face. She listened intently as he explained what had happened, and together, they embarked on a frantic search for their beloved Max. Days turned into nights, and nights turned into weeks. Mr. and Mrs. Johnson scarred the town following every lead and asking everyone they met if they had seen a golden retriever wandering alone. They put up missing dog posters on every street corner, hoping that someone would bring news of their cherished companion. The Johnsons' hearts ached with worry and sadness. Sleepless nights were spent calling out Max's name, hoping against hope that he would come bounding back into their arms. They couldn't bear the thought of him being lost, frightened, or injured. Their search led them to the local animal shelters, where they checked kennel after kennel, scanning the sad faces of abandoned dogs. Each time, their hearts sank a little more, as Max was nowhere to be found. The shelter staff offered kind words of support and urged them not to lose hope, but the Johnsons couldn't shake off the lingering sense of despair. Weeks turned into months, and the months stretched into years. The Johnsons never stopped searching for Max. They couldn't bring themselves to replace him with another dog, for Max had left indelible paw print on their hearts. The pain of his absence became a constant ache, a void that could not be filled. Meanwhile, Max had unknowingly ended up at an animal shelter on the outskirts of town. The shelter, nestled among towering trees and surrounded by nature's embrace, provided refuge for countless stray and abandoned animals. Max's once vibrant spirit began to dwindle as the days turned into weeks and the weeks turned into months. The shelter staff did their best to care for Max, providing him with food, water, and a warm place to sleep. They showered him with affection, hoping to bring a glimmer of happiness back into his sad eyes. Yet, no matter how much they tried, Max's heart remained heavy with longing for his family. As the years passed, Max's once playful demeanor faded away. He became a mere shadow of his former self, spending his days lying in a corner of his small kennel. His eyes, once filled with joy and excitement, now mirrored the profound sadness that consumed his spirit. And so Max's days turned into a monotonous routine of longing and despair, the vibrant energy he once possessed fading away like a distant memory. The shelter staff could see the spark of life diminishing in Max's eyes and felt a profound sadness for the dog who had lost his way. It was one day when the shelter staff gathered in the office preparing to make an adoption post on their website. They knew that finding forever homes for their furry residents was crucial, but today would bring an unexpected surprise. As the shelter staff bustled around arranging the dogs for their pictures, they couldn't help but notice Max's somber expression. His eyes reflected the weight of the years spent longing for his family, his loyal heart still aching with the memories of home. They hoped that capturing his photograph would somehow capture the hearts of those seeking a faithful companion. Unbeknownst to the shelter staff, thousands of miles away in the comfort of their home, Mr. and Mrs. Johnson were sitting together, their laptop perched on their laps. It had become their routine, searching through various adoption websites and lost pet forums, always holding on to a glimmer of hope that one day they would find their precious Max. The clicking sound of the keyboard echoed through the room as they scrolled through countless pictures of dogs in need of a loving home. They saw sad eyes, wagging tails, and hopeful faces, but none of them matched the image etched in their hearts, 
the image of their beloved Max. Then, as if guided by an invisible force, Mrs. Johnson clicked on a link that led them to the shelter's website. It seemed like an ordinary shelter, but something caught their eye. A small photo of a golden retriever, his expression a mixture of longing and resignation. Time seemed to freeze as their eyes locked onto the image. They read the description beneath the photograph, searching for any additional details that might confirm their suspicions. The words seemed to dance before their eyes, telling the story of a lost dog, abandoned and searching for a home, a story that resonated deeply within their souls. Unable to contain their emotions any longer, Mr. Johnson reached for the phone and dialed the shelter's number, his voice trembling with anticipation. As he spoke with the shelter staff, his heart skipped a beat when they confirmed that the dog in the picture was indeed Max their Max. Emotions overflowed as the Johnsons hung up the phone. Their long and arduous journey had led them to this moment, a moment of hope and the possibility of finally reuniting with their beloved furry friend. Their home suddenly filled with a renewed sense of purpose and energy as they made immediate plans to visit the shelter. The journey to the shelter felt like an eternity, the car ride fraught with nervous excitement. Their minds swirled with a mix of emotions, hope, fear, and a desperate longing to hold Max in their arms once again. The anticipation built with each passing mile, the scenery outside becoming a blur as they neared their destination. Finally, they arrived at the shelter, their hearts pounding in their chests. The Johnsons were greeted by the shelter staff who, unaware of the remarkable connection about to unfold, led them towards Max's kennel. The Johnsons clung to each other, their steps filled with a mixture of apprehension and hope. Finally, they stood before the door, their hearts pounding in their chests. The moment of truth had arrived. With trembling hands, the staff member unlocked the kennel door, revealing a sight that would forever be etched in their memories. There in front of them stood Max, his eyes wide with a mixture of surprise and familiarity. Max. Mrs. Johnson's voice cracked with emotion as she called out his name, her voice a mixture of love and longing. Max's ears perked up and he slowly turned his head. Max had come home and the Johnsons vowed to cherish every moment with him, knowing that the bond they shared was unbreakable and had triumphed over the passage of time. That's all for this video. Please like, share, subscribe, and turn on the notification for more such videos. Till then. Take care. Thanks for watching.